Before we get into any more questions, I want to bring up a topic that was very recent as of the other day that I'm going to show you guys. And this is, I'm going to show you on screen right now, Nico Mulali creates his own mountain bike frame, drops any of his contracts with his bike sponsor, picks <clears throat> up the contracts that he wants. He's riding with companies that he prefers, not just following the money. And I think this is pretty yeah, freaking I love dope. It. Yeah. I love it. It's, it's really, really cool. The bike looks good. You can run the parts he wants and... Yeah, I mean, you can do it's. I mean, I'm not saying we're at like that point, but that's how it is when you don't ride professionally for like a bike brand. You can ride whatever you want. Well, either way, his intense bikes were basically an entirely. They weren't even intense. They were like a completely different frame and everything. Yeah, he was customized it all. Well, that's what he said. I don't know if you guys did. You listen to the vital phone call with him? Yeah, mm -hmm. you did. Yeah, he talked in there about like how it is a little bit working with these companies where. You don't just get to do whatever you want because those companies have to take into account, like, is this change good for marketing purposes and is it going to be good for the general, like, public and not just you? So oftentimes, like, you can't accomplish everything you want to without, like, mm. with having a sponsor, like, kind of controlling it a little bit. So I think it's, I think it's pretty cool. No, nah, I think it's really cool. I hope he kills it. He said he's put together, like, a team too, right? Wasn't there something like that? So, <laughs> speaking of that, Chase and I kind of talked about it, joked a little bit. Uh, another big name, Luca Shaw, left Santa Cruz, but he didn't say where we're going, and Chase kind of said, uh, I'll let you say it. It'd be cool if he, uh, like, teamed up with Nico. And they, he like, should, the they two. made their, they're both, they live right there. They yeah, both yeah. ride at Canuga all the time. Why don't you just, like, team up, ride whatever you want, but, like, train together because they're already probably going to train together anyway. Well, what about uh, Dakota Norton? Didn't he Him too. with YT? Yeah, why, well... Well, that they, one's they a weird drop. one. <laughs> That's that a weird one. Mystery. They just like said, "Ah, we're done with downhill yeah, racing." Yeah, they ended the whole, the whole squad, I, which makes no sense. Why? Oishin O'Callaghan was insane. He was so fast. Dak was super fast. The I know he had fast. a great year. It's like, probably yeah, really good. I don't even. I mean, I have no idea. I would like to know why. I, I wish they would have said why, so there wasn't a bunch of just rumors going around. Like, is it because they like uh, just don't have enough bikes, or yeah, is it because of the shortage, or what? I just I wish they would have well, said why. If it's gonna be Dak, Luca, and Nico, it's gonna be like Atherton. People are gonna want these bikes. That would be so if sick. There's yeah. all three of those guys. That's like all the USA fast guys. I don't know if that's his like. I mean, I obviously don't know. I don't know Nico like I don't at know all. So do, I don't know if like that's. If his plan is just to create the best race bike for him himself personally, and that's like the end of the like goals, or if he's mm -hmm. thinking like maybe, hey, I can make a really fast race bike and sell it specifically for racers and not like all the other brands that make bikes for the general public. Can you buy an Atherton bike? I don't know. If yes, you, because I, I talked can. to them about buying one. Mm. They're making them. They're making. I'm pretty like sure a, they're very similar geometry to the one that Nico kind of just. So he, they look talked similar, that, yeah. he talked in that phone call. He has two bikes right now with different, a little bit, <laughs> slightly different geos. Yeah. One high pivot, one normal, I guess. So, yeah, that'd be dope. Fish, Fish is saying he wonders if Dak and Luca are joining Nico's team. Uh, that would be super dope to really see savage. like a USA super team. That would yeah. be insane.